G'day, it's Pete here and I'm back for Hand of the Week. Now, this hand actually came from a Money Bridge game and there was a comedy of errors, sort of, but also, like, they were on the verge of some really cool play as well. Um, anyway, we'll jump straight into it and have a look at what actually happened. So, I was sitting south and the west player was the other human player and there were two uh, robots here. Anyway, my partner opened one club and uh, that went past and I bid a diamond and the next guy bid one spade and my partner made a support double and East just rose to two spades and I was like mm, I don't want to sell out to two spades so I'll, I'll compete to three diamonds and West also with their nine card spade fit didn't want to sell out to three diamonds so they pushed all the way to three spades and this went past four spades by the robot which I yeah, I don't like. If you're not going to Q raise on this, you shouldn't overrule your partner's decision. Anyway, for me, this option just screamed for a double. I didn't really have many defensive tricks, but yeah, like West didn't want to try and bid game. Uh, they don't have that many points, so um, like my partner's opened and I've got uh, nine points. So on principle, I just doubled this and it went all pass. Now, we're entitled to three heart tricks, um, a diamond and a spade. Um, but my partner started with Ace of Hearts and then uh, King of Hearts and then another heart, which actually got rid of our diamond trick. So uh, we, we get our heart, but uh, now the fourth heart's actually set up to uh, um, throw a diamond away. At any rate, I still switched to diamonds. I switched to the King of Diamonds and went uh, King Ace Small and the Clara now uh, played a low spade and went to the ace. So with the uh, 10 there and dummy, I've actually set up for um, another trick here. Um, so I'll get my spade trick at this stage, but uh, they played the jack of hearts and I roughed in and they just threw a diamond away. Uh, my partner didn't throw a diamond, they threw a club. So it uh, went Jack of Hearts rough, and I didn't, can't play the Queen of Diamonds now because they're just rough and the diamond's good. So I came out the Jack of Spades, and they won. And my partner pitched another one. And now it looks like Declara is going to lose a, uh, a club and... Like, a club and a... Yeah, they're just going to lose a club, really. Uh, but I've got a couple of things they can do. So, first of all, uh, if they just play a spade over to the 10 and then rough a diamond and then run all their trumps, what happens is dummy will, like, I'll have to hold on to the queen of diamonds and my jack of clubs. Um, but the east hand has to hold on to ace, 10 of clubs and the diamond. And the dummy will actually get squeezed first. So, uh, we'll just show what happens here. I'll, I'll undo back to this point. Um, but uh, let's just see what happens if they lead a spade over. It goes to the 10. And now they lead a low diamond. I play low and they rough. And they play another spade. And I pitch a diamond. And then on a final spade, it goes like this. And ace gets to discard. Whatever they discard, I discard as well. And no one gets squeezed. But Declara actually did better than this. Um, so if we backtrack uh, to this point. So to clear it, what they did is they actually let the jack of diamonds off. So they let the jack of diamonds, and I have to cover this because they know I've got the queen. Um, and or if I don't cover it, they just pitch a club. So uh, queen of diamonds, and they roughed. And now they've actually transferred the menace. So now my partner is the only person guarding diamonds. So when they play another spade here, it goes club, and they pitch a club. And now when they play another spade, uh, my partner has to hold on to the diamond or else that eight's good, so they let go of a club. And they see that they haven't seen the diamond uh, set up yet, so they throw that away. And my partner actually got squeezed so that uh, their king of clubs has to drop singleton. And they've got count of the hand as well because of the support double. They know that my partner had uh, only three diamonds, three hearts, and a singleton spade. So they've got complete count of the hand. They transferred the menace. They squeezed them. And then they led the Queen of Clubs. So I got my Jack of Clubs in the end. But I was like, wow, this guy played it like real, like obviously they shouldn't be in four space, but he played it really well, transferred the menace, squeezed my partner, and then played the wrong club. 
So I got to score my Jack in the end for plus 300. And I, yeah, I just really enjoyed this hand. Um, so like the bidding was pretty poor from uh, the East hand. The defense was pretty poor from my partner. The declaring play here was really good right up until the last two cards where they played the wrong club because they managed to transfer the menace. They then squeezed my partner and then just got it wrong. And what they did is, well, like, it's not no play, but if you trust the bidding, it's no play. But uh, yeah, <laughs> I just found this one funny. So I hope you enjoyed this hand and thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.